So how can you get the Memoji face tracking on the iPad? Let's get started. So at first, what you need to make sure is that your iPad supports Face ID. Because if the iPad doesn't have that, well, it doesn't track your face for the Memojis either. So you can figure it out if you are not sure by going to the settings and then when you scroll down, you can find either Face ID and Passcode or Touch ID and Passcode, depending on the model. Like, so the iPad mini, for example, has the Touch ID or and the iPad Pro has the Face ID, right? So if you have an iPad with Face ID, you can open up the messages, right? And start a random conversation with someone on iMessage. Click on the plus icon right there and you can scroll through the options and you will be able to get to the Memojis. And there you can start moving your face around and it should be tracked, right? So you can see that the little characters should replicate your movements. So you can now record yourself and send it to that person or just record it and save it to your iPad for some kind of different purpose. What's important to know is that um, it doesn't have like a separate dedicated application. It's not like you can get an app on your iPad where you just perform all of these things. It has to be done through the messages. So if you don't have iMessage set up, you won't be able to get it to this. So it is a little bit of like a hidden feature or like a little hidden away, but you can get it to work if you really wish to. I know some people which would just start a screen recording inside of the messages right and then just record their memoji character and have it saved in the gallery so that is another alternative on how you can export it so to speak right so if you wanted to do that that is an option as well so let me know below in the comments if this is what you are going after with the memoji face tracking subscribe for more tutorials and videos like this one in the future and i will see you later in the next one <laughs>